What's up everybody? This is uh, Diego with Love Designs. Today I have a Vizio 32 inch. Uh, model number... Oh. Hold on one second. Let me unplug this. Whoa. It's not cool. My bad. Model number is... B3 or E320 B0E. Alright, and short story. We got this TV. They didn't want to turn on. Actually, it did turn on. Uh, it did more of a more of a, a flash. And then the V for Vizio came on, but then it turned right off. I uh, replaced both boards. This is a power supply and the main board. Um, I didn't think it was the LEDs because when I took the LCD off, I looked at all the LEDs when it flashed, they all came on. Uh, come to think, come to actually find out that these LEDs are not all that great. Uh, one of these LEDs is bad. And I tested them uh, with the multimeter. Basically, you go to the diode section and you just test on one lead against the other lead uh, individually though. so there's some test points here that you can use so right there I got 853 and I'm basically testing on you know the negative side to the positive side of each every single LED uh, turns out that the very very last one was the one that actually was not passing anything. So I ended up just saying, screw it, let's get rid of it. The LED's still there, but I have a, I soldered a piece of wire there uh, to just kind of continue the, the circuit. Uh, this is one flow, one whole circuit there, which is uh, pretty annoying. But you gotta do what you gotta do, right? Um, then, I was able to find out that it actually works now. It actually will stay on. Before the... Sorry, guys. Before the, the TV would flash on, and then the standby light would uh, flash, and then it would go off. It would fade off. But now we're about to start it right here. Push button. 